thought I thought that I thought that Jermaine won the fight too, and I just and I understand that you can't win a fight or championship backing up. It's a strategy, bro. I mean, come on. I mean, it's a, it's a strategy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Y'all could boo all you want. Suck a dick, no homo. That's what's next for me. None of these guys want to fight me. I fight Crawford out of catch weight. And the controversy continues. Who won the fight Thursday night? My prediction for this fight was the T Fimo. He was so laser focused on fighting Terrence Crawford. I thought he was going to annihilate Jermaine Ortiz late in this fight. It didn't happen that way. Actually, it almost went the other way. Jermaine Ortiz had a head early, but just like the Lomachenko fight, he started fading the second half of the fight. With that being said, T.O. didn't do much in this fight, but I thought he did just enough, and Jermaine Ortiz did just a little for him to retain his belts. My score was 114-114. I had it a draw because I wasn't impressed with either guy. But I was very disappointed in Tiafimo. We want to bring all these guys up and make them elite fighters. Tiafimo is a good fighter. He's not elite yet. He does have elite talent, but he's not elite yet. Tiafimo cannot fight on his front foot. Tiafimo can't cut off the ring. His jab wasn't that great. And where's the body work? Tiafimo has great athleticism in the ring and he's very talented, but he does not have the skills yet to beat a technical boxer. He is pretty good with guys that are coming to him, but when he has to hunt for the guys, not so great. His footwork is good when a guy's coming to him, but he's fighting off the back foot. But when he has to hunt, his footwork is not that great. It's a lot of things he needs to work on, and I think he needs a new trainer in camp. I don't think his I think his dad took him far enough, and it's time to bring another guy in. Shout out to Miss Montez. She's been saying that for a while that T Fimo needs a new trainer. And he's not good against technical fighters. Sandal Martin, people thought he lost that fight. And now we have this fight on Thursday that people thought he lost. Both fighters fought Southpaw. Also, Tifimo was forced to fight on his front foot. Now, this is the same guy that criticized Terrence Crawford's record. At least all Crawford's wins was not debatable. He won those fights. Tia Fimo has like three, two or three fights that people are debating that he won or not. Tia Fimo could have four losses on his record. You know, they questioned the Sandra Martin fight. They questioned the Jermaine Ortiz fight. Some even questioned, did he beat Loma? I'm not one of them. I thought he beat Loma, but that's still up in the air and why he didn't give him a rematch. And there's a reason why he was crying after the fight. That wasn't tears of joy. Tiafimo thought he blew it. He thought he lost his belt to Jermaine Ortiz. Don't get it twisted. Those were not tears of joy. He thought once again, he lost. And as far as him wanting Tans Crawford, that was all cap. He know damn well he's not going to get Crawford at a catch weight. Terrence Crawford say he has problems making 147. Why would he fight Tiafimo at 144? He's not the A side like that. As a matter of fact, Tiafimo is not a big draw. Last night wasn't even a sellout. And another point is, after after agree with Regis Progress when he said this, Tiafimo was more dominant at 135. He's having more trouble at 140. The punching power is not as big as it was at 135. And when you think about it, this was Jermaine Ortiz's first fight at 135. One part of being elite is being consistent. And Team Fimo is so inconsistent, and he has glaring holes in his game. So I'm like Rick Glazer. I cannot call him the takeover yet. But with that being said, like I said, I had the fighters a draw. So I don't think Team Fimo deserves to lose his title. But I am disappointed because he's not far along as a boxer as I thought he was. And as of right now, I would pick Tank and Devin Haney to beat Tiafimo. And before the Sandra Martin fight and the Jermaine Ortiz fight, I thought Tiafimo was right in the mix. But I don't think he wins those fights anymore. Maybe he'll change my mind down the line. And Tiafimo should look at tape of Julio Cesar Chavez, an all-time great, 
who was an expert in cutting the ring off. Anyway, who won the fight? Ortiz or Tifimo Lopez? JBZ, I'm gone.